and a gruesome discovery in Philadelphia's East Germantown neighborhood, a body in a trash bag. Police believe it may be the remains of a woman who went missing last month. Eyewitness News reporter Jan Carabello is live outside of police headquarters with more. Good morning, Jan. Jim, good morning. Investigators have not yet positively identified the human remains that were found in that trash bag yesterday. However, investigators do believe they could belong to a woman from Haverford Township that police there had been searching for since the end of May. A gruesome discovery in East Germantown Tuesday evening. Human remains found in a trash bag in a vacant lot under a bridge on the 5700 block of Musgrave Street. Densely weeded trees, brush about 10 feet high behind a fence. This all unfolded around 6 o'clock yesterday evening. Eyewitness News was there as Philadelphia's crime scene unit and medical examiner's office processed the scene. But it was actually Haverford Township investigators who first notified Philly police that human remains had been discovered there. Investigators got information that the body was dumped in the 5700 block of Musgrave Street and we believe the body was here at least three weeks, maybe longer. Haverford Township Police believe the remains belong to a missing 25 year old woman they'd been searching for since May 22nd. Investigators believe her death now spans three different municipalities in two different counties. They believe this woman disappeared in Haverford Township, was killed in Upper Darby and then dumped in East Germantown. An investigation by Haverford Township looking for this 25 year old missing female as well as a joint investigation with Upper Darby Police who believe that the female after going missing was actually killed inside of a property in Upper Darby. That's what led us to this location. And as you heard, this is now a joint investigation involving Philly Police, Haverford Township Police, and Upper Darby Police. We are awaiting word on a positive identification this morning. As soon as we get that information, we will pass it right along to you. For now, we are live outside of the Philly Police Department. Jan Carabao, CBS3 Eyewitness News. Jim, back into you. Thank you, Jan.